I thought today I'd show you a, a photograph that's got a slight color cast to it and how we're going to go about removing it. <clears throat> so I'm going to take uh, this image and I'm going to make a duplicate copy of the background layer above it. Okay. Next thing I want to do is go into my adjustment uh, layer palettes here and I'm going to choose threshold. And when I th choose threshold, it bring brings up a uh, black and white image. <clears throat> I'm going to move this slider all the way over to the left until the image totally disappears into white. And then what I'm going to do is slowly bring it back until just I get the first inkling of something black. Okay? Now, if if I bring my cursor out of this dialog box, you'll see that it magically appears as an eyedropper. And what we're going to do is we're going to tell Photoshop this is the blackest part of this photograph. So I'm going to hold down my shift key and I'm going to mark this with a target right here. Uh, you, I don't think you can see the target yet. We'll put a little crosshair mark right there. <clears throat> So what we'll do is now we'll move this slider all the way over to the right until the image turns black. Once the image turns black, I'm going to start to bring it back very slowly until the first bit of white appears. And now I'll hold down my shift key and now I'll click on an area that has just turned white right here. And I'm done with the threshold. I don't need it. Do not click OK. Click Cancel. You don't need it anymore. It's done what we wanted to. It's marked both both spots for us, but you can't see them just yet until you do one thing. you got to bring up the Curves dialog box. So we're going to hold down Control m to bring up the Curves dialog box. Let me bring it in here. And now you can see our little two, two crosshairs right here and right here and in your curves dialog box you'll see you'll have a set of three eyedroppers the first one is is uh, to set the black point and the third one is to set the white point and we've already done that in threshold so we're going to tell Photoshop this is the blackest part of that this photograph right here so we're just going to click that area that little that little crosshair right in the middle until it, that's the blackest part of the photograph. Now we'll go into and we're going to sample the whitest part of the photograph which we determined in threshold was right here. And now we're done. All you have to do is click OK. And that was our before and that's our after. Thank you.